Hello, it's Susan and I am here with another book review for you. I think I've said several times before that I'm really reading a lot of, a lot of romance books lately and thrillers. Well, I'm telling you, I just read a terrific thriller. It's the new Ruth Ware book, One by One. This was so great. She really never disappoints. I've read all of her books but one and I've never been disappointed by any of them. Well, I really loved this one because it was set at a ski chalet in the Swiss Alps, and I just love books set in ski chalets. To me, a ski chalet sounds so cozy. There's fires, there's snow, it's cold outside. You can sit there and read, drink some nice tea. It just paints such a warm and cozy picture. Well, throw in a thriller, maybe not so warm and cozy. But this one was really enjoyable. So it's about a group of people who are going on a trip for their business. They have started this app, it's called Snoop. And so basically what the app does is you can listen to music that celebrities are listening to in real time. So pretty interesting concept for an app. But anyway, so this company goes on a ski trip. They all have a bunch of secrets. They're trying to talk about whether they should sell out. They've been offered a huge amount of money to sell the company and they're all fighting about whether they should do it and get their payout or whether they should keep going and maybe get a bigger payout later. So this book keeps switching point of views between several different people, um, people who work at the ski chalet and then people who are part of this company. And this one is a chilling book and not just because it's set with a bunch of snow. So what happens in this book as they're fighting inside, all of a sudden a big storm comes up and they're all trapped together. They can't get down to the village, they can't ski, which is why they went there to begin with. And all of a sudden secrets start coming out, people's tempers flare, and then there's an avalanche. So basically this book is about people being trapped together with no escape, and I don't want to say more because I don't want to spoil anything, but this one was so good. The title of this book and kind of the concept of it really kind of reminded me of an Agatha Christie book, maybe something like And Then There Was None, but it doesn't have the same ending, so that's not a spoiler. But anyway, it just reminded me even the title of it like one by one, but I loved this book. It was so suspenseful. Yes, I did guess the, one of the twists early on, but it really didn't take away from my enjoyment of the book. I loved it. Cover's great. It just kind of has like an avalanche, but I really like how big and bold the title is too, and the colors really complement each other. So this is another terrific cover, but come in, check this out, find out all the exciting stuff that I don't want to give away. This one will keep you turning the pages until the very end. So come on in, check this one out, and let us know what you think about it. But thanks for joining us, and we'll have more book reviews for you soon. Don't forget to check us out at noonancarnegie.com. And we have so many other book reviews on our YouTube page, our Facebook page, our Instagram page, all of that. You can check out all the various programs that we've been doing. So definitely um, check out and see what you've missed. Thanks so much for joining us.